copyright notices if you wish to read pause the video the original videos are linked in the description down below enjoy all right then so in this one what you're gonna see is uh, a constable knocking on three doors because the numbers are a b c and he doesn't know which one it is so he knocks on all three asking for a person which is not there and on top of it he has got no epaulets on display at all he does identify himself but he still has got no epaulets on display let's just get straight into this one why are you banging out my door mate just chill out I'm, I am chills out. I want you okay. to know why you're you're banging at my door. Okay, I knocked at your door. No, you you've been banging at it. Yeah, I've knocked three times. It's on phone, mate. Alright. Yeah, so don't lie. Right, yeah. Okay. What's your number? Two seven eight nine. What's your name? PC Crane. What's your station? The OCC. What's that? Operational Command Centre. I'm a dog owner, right? Yeah. Basically, mate, I'm off to Francis Sheridan. Does he live here? Is this Francis Sheridan's address? Right. I'll speak to, I'll say to Is you this Francis... I'm asking you a question here, officer. Is this Francis he's, Sheridan's address? He's given it as his address. He's given this... Yes, so that's why I'm here, just to verify no, he lives here. No, you're I'm, wrong. He's not getting locked. You're wrong. I'm not wrong, he gave the address. I, right. he, and what address is this? 43 Wordsworth. Oh, is it? Yeah. yeah. This isn't 43 Wordsworth, mate. What is this, then? This is 43C Wordsworth. There's no C on your door. What's that there? Is that 43A there, mate? Alright, but... Mate, is that 43A there? Do you know what, mate? Your attitude stinks. Your attitude stinks, doesn't can it? Can you see that? 43A? Yeah, can I see that there? 43. Oh. Okay, then, so I don't want to be on the copper's... Sound like I'm on the copper's side on this one, because... I... I am and I'm not. So I'm on the line on this one, because... Obviously, the copper come out with straight away... Uh, calm down. This guy asked him a simple question. He, fair enough, he hasn't got his epilepsy on display, but when asked to identify, he identified himself straight away with everything he needed to. But, again, for the person recording, if you don't have a seat on your door, it's not the officer's fault. He has just been sent to that address. And unfortunately for you, you don't have your seat on your door, so he's knocked on yours at 45. Or 43 or whatever the fuck it is and it's an honest mistake if you had the C on the door maybe you wouldn't have knocked but you don't have the C on the door it's not very obvious considering it's come up a flight of stairs and the first one is met with is the number has been sent then it goes a B and A now if it was the other way around it went A, B, C then yeah so I can un sort of understand, and then the, the coffer at the end, the attitude, is saying your attitude stinks. Well, that's because of the, your uniform, mate. Everybody has the same feelings uh, towards the uniform. It's not you personally, it's your uniform. But can you see 43, 43, 43? But you've decided to bang my door up, screaming and shouting. All right, mate, Sam. If it's not you, that's fine. No issue. Yeah. Nice no apology, you. no. Well, not no with apology. Not with gas to me, no. No. So this constable here has let his emotions get in the way of, perform of performing his duty. So, like he just said, because of your attitude, I'm not going to apologise. Well, he's got attitude, mate, because he's been banging on his door for no reason. Oh my god, he's literally going all around the houses asking for a franny. I live here, mate, don't tell me to go away. I know, but you're just you're following me before. I'm you? not following you. So I live here. I'm allowed to be here. I'm speaking to me neighbour. Alright, sound. And what, I'm not allowed to be here? I haven't said that you're not allowed to be here, have I? You've just told me to go away. Anywho. Uh, you, you see him warmed up, mate, that's all. So I just want you to move away, you're a bit warmed up. Just go and chill out over there. You just got me up out of bed with a bloody police car, don't you, Bang, 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 bang. And I see him a bit riled up, do I? Oh, I mean, he must be bloody mad. I'll just give you a clue, yeah. You know when someone man. gives you an address, yeah? And they say 43. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. One, two, three. Try and find out which 43, oh, I mean, yeah. Give you the address to someone else, what? Right. what? It's nothing to do with me. Oh, the grass give you the address, did they? Oh, I think it's not. Yeah. Yeah. Well, does anyone go Francis with you? No. No. 
Is, is there enough of what you were aware of? Just three of them, mate. If you ask the right question, you might, you might get a little bit of info you're after. I'm asking him, mate, because your, yeah. your attitude stinks, so I was asking him. My attitude stinks. Bang, 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 bang. Um, right. mm. It's weird, yeah. It's just, I'm rubbing my eyes as well. I'm asleep. <laughs> um, yeah, no, it's fine. Mate, honestly, the reason why I'm not there is because there's no C on your door, so I thought I was, it was confusing, so I thought that not, because that was the number 43 alone. I'm after number 43 alone, and that is... There's no is... such thing as 43 alone, mate. Have a look. A, B, C. I know, mate, but you've got, no, you've got no C on your door, so that's why I've knocked, OK? It's not unreasonable. It's 10 o'clock in the morning, so it's not an unreasonable time. I've been at work since 7, so I could have knocked then, but I didn't. I've, I've waited until now to knock to make sure that no one lives there, called Francis. You've answered the door with your, phone, with your mobile phone in my face, saying that... I have, yeah, because the fucking police are outside my door right. for no reason, banging on me bloody you door. Got a problem with the police, then? Go back inside. Is this your go-to? That's all she's have ever got over. You got a problem with the police? Okay, so like I said, it's very reasonable for this officer to assume that that there was 43, considering you did see on the door there was no ear on, I mean, C on the door whatsoever. So a reasonable person would reasonably assume that that was 43. Like I said, that other door you can clearly see an ear, that other one you can clearly see a C. And is. I mean, a B and his, you can't see nothing, so there is no C on his door. So a reasonable person would reasonably believe that that is the address he is looking for. So, I don't know this area, I don't know if it goes 43, 43A, 43B, 43C, 40CD, and so on and so on and so on. I know some flats do it like that, but I'm not sure. And for him saying it's, you will, you banged us up, it's half past ten, he said, well, it's a reasonable time. Yes, it is a reasonable time, but some people work until two, three o'clock in the morning, and then they get home, and then they sleep through most of the day to go back to work, because that's the, the night shifts they've got, or them, them hours they've got at that moment in time. Just because you was up at seven o'clock, it doesn't mean everybody's up at seven o'clock. Now, I've got a problem with the police banging at me door. Sam, I've got Unbelievable. <laughs> so we've, 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 we've banged off 43A, we've banged off 43C. No, let's mate, try 40, let's try 43B. You've just knocked at his door. He didn't come to his door till you knocked didn't at his he? door. Didn't he? All right, mate. Are you off your cap? I've just filmed you knocking right. at his door. Listen, lads, I am going to give you a pass because you've been up all night, but that's just mental to say that. <laughs> you've just literally knocked at his door. Oh, but yeah. come on, let's try round three. Oh, Cranger, <laughs> See you later, Franny. <laughs> see you later, Fran. Yeah, see you later, Fran. Fucking hell, we're all Franny. Every bloody house in Wordsworth. Any door with 43 on. Hey. So if you watch the footage back, this copper did not knock on. 43 ear the door was already open before he got there so no he did not knock it was probably down to all the loudness of your bow and probably shouting at each other that this person had woke up but he's still knocking on every single door he would have knocked on that door if they didn't come to the door as you've seen, that has gone to number 43B and started knocking on that one. What was your number again, sorry? You've got it on your house. What was it? Because I can't see it on your uh, shoulders. Right, right. Looks like you're not wearing any identifying numbers yeah, to me. Yeah, you already see it on no, well, Oh, so you're admitting you're not actually wearing any identifying numbers? I've got my warrant card and I'll give you my... I've got wow! Card. Wow! Have you seen this, people? This is what Merseyside Police, this is, this is their MO, their modus operandi. 
No identifying numbers, but when they get put in the shit, they'll give it to you when asked. Put in what shit? What? I'm knocking on doors, mate. Where, the... Where's your identity? Where's your shoulder, Edward? I really fast, give me number. No, but I, you've got to wear them, mate, to identify no, 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 yourself. No, no, I've got a jacket on. You've got a jacket on? Yeah, I passed yeah. my call number. Yeah, your outer jacket is the one that's got to show the numbers, mate. Look at this, people. If you're, Nothing. If you're, uh, Look at this. If you're questioning my warrants or ID, mate, just call 101 and pass me call I'm number. I'm questioning you. Can verify, you can verify that I've been here today. If you, you're just looking for any issue now. You're trying to pick fault with anything. You are not You are not identifiable, officer. Clearly, I woke you up. Well, in fact, actually, are you... Of course I am, yeah. mate. You've just been banging on me, door. Go back to bed. No, I'm waiting until you leave. Oh, yes, yeah. Fucking crazy, people. Right, mate, Sam. See you later. Still no apology. No identifying you features apology, you whatsoever. You don't get an apology you speak to people like that, mate. Let's see if I get an apology off the PSD, eh? Alright, mate, Sam. See you later, officer. So that's the end of that interaction, yes, every single police officer, well, police constable, which is performing their duty, should have their epilep numbers on display at all times. Now what you're seeing is a lot of them sticking it on their chest, so they're not on the shoulders anymore, they'll have one on the chest, which is there, like, well, it is on display, but we can hide it because we can just cross our arms and stuff like that, that's their way of hiding their numbers, so it's harder to identify them. But... They should have their numbers on display at all times. And when asked by a member of the public to identify themselves, they should tell the numbers. Uh, they don't have to give you the name, but they should do give you the surname, the number, and the station they work out of. This, this constable did do all that when asked, but again, he's got no identification numbers on him. Oh, and he can show his warrant card as well. But all this is just like my opinion. Let us know in the comments down below what you thought of this interaction. As always, like the video, it does up in YouTube's algorithm. And I'll catch you on the next one.